Is there anyone else you met during this whole thing that you were you were nervous around? Bill Murray. I got dinner with Bill Murray. What? I know. I know. I know. I know. I didn't. I'm not worthy of this. Like, what the fuck? But fuck him, please. I know. So here's a funny story. So I'll tell you. I'll just give you the cliff notes. And look, I'm just a hero. Childhood know, hero. Like it really, truly is. Like I can't, If you were to name one actor since the SNL heyday who's just completely had the best trajectory, never fallen off, never. can do an indie movie and then go do a Marvel. Like yeah. He's the best like yeah. truly the best i mean i think about like all just every era he dominated everything like, you know, then like the 90s now. rushmore it, it's like dude. right right yeah. we're talking about what about bob earlier we're talking about groundhog day we're talking about, dude i remember with the movie with uh quaid he did uh quick change is a great oh, movie great remember movie that? yeah now, I got these. So we all agree. We can all agree he's sort of like on Mount Rushmore of, yeah. of yes. sorts. Okay, so for sure. Um, I was. It was sort of at the end of Cannes Film Festival. We were out there. Our movie was nominated for the Palme d'Or, which is like a category. This is all new to me, so I'm explaining it because I didn't know this. But at the Cannes Film Festival, which is the Oscar of film festivals, there's certain, uh, you know. Uh, different categories and the main one you want is the palm d'or category that's mm. like the best movies get put in this like 10 movie slot and ours made it into there which in itself is like bucket list shit like just to be in that conversation totally what else is there uh we were there uh, this guy who caleb landry jones won for a uh, lead actor for a movie called neitrum which is martin backwards about the mass shooting in australia a lot of like art house indie movies that are just coming out now or maybe wow. you missed uh we were up against um like uh, the one, um, Bill Murray was in, what's the Wes Anderson one? Uh, oh, French Dispatch. French Dispatch. Oh, yeah. So, you know, you kind of just get a little mix of movies, but mostly kind of cool indie movies, right? So anyway, Bill Murray's there um, for that movie. And at the very last night, after we found out we didn't get, you know, uh, best movie, or I was actually somehow in the conversation for best actor, which still is just hilarious, uh, <laughs> we go out to dinner with, and the woman who was the head of the French distribution company, as a surprise to me and Sean Baker, since she felt bad we didn't win, goes, hey, let's go to dinner, I got a surprise for you. Oh, so we're boy. sitting at dinner, and Bill Murray shows wow. up. Wow. And at this point, I'm so emotionally and mentally tapped out from like the five days at Cannes of like, the circus that was the sure. and Festival. you're probably doing a lot of interviews and stuff yeah i was just zapped yeah. out i didn't know he was coming and i say hey sean can i get an edible he brought edibles with oh, him oh so boy. i eat an edible because i'm like we're done i'm having dinner yeah and bill murray comes and i'm not only exhausted but i'm so high i got nothing <laughs> like, like, you know when you get too high and yeah. you're like locked up and you're oh like, I totally and it was like edible high where you're like fucked up and yeah. tired and i'm just sitting there with them and it was kind of like the round table thing i was just saying i'm like act like you belong here yeah yeah i'm a yeah. total piece of shit he's the best <laughs> <laughs> so i'm sitting there with them and he's like feeling that i'm being kind of quiet so he keeps like slapping me on the knees like so what's up i'm hearing about wow. your movie he's engaging with me b being really cool yeah and and we're drinking wine and we're hanging out and he's fucking with the waiter but in like the coolest way ah. watching him interact with the world like he was like improving with everyone yeah but in this way that was really interesting to watch because people would come up and bother him but he would deflect it in this way that was like these aren't the droids you're looking for right like he right. was a jedi at wow. dealing with fans yeah wow. i remember just sitting back and i know i was high so i was over analyzing but i was just watching him going take notes learn from this guy he knows how to do it and like we we're walking through the street of Cannes in France and like people are coming up drunk and rowdy and he literally would just do like a hey what's up and like a spin move off of them and like somehow not bum them out or it, it was wow. magical to watch yeah yeah it was magical to watch but I was just kind of quiet and awkward so I see him the other night at the Vanity Fair party and yeah. I'm like redemption time I gotta go talk to him right yeah so I go up to him and they had in and out catering okay. so he was finishing Ooh. an in and out burger and I roll up to him in my tuxedo and I look at him I go hey Bill do you remember me we had dinner and can and he looks me up and down takes his burger wrapper puts it in my inside pocket <laughs> of my jacket slaps the pocket and goes yeah we had dinner at a middle eastern restaurant and walked away oh! like yeah I rem but he did it but again he did it in a way that was like yeah i remember i'm not gonna hang out with you yeah but you're cool here's a funny little joke i'm out and i was wow. just like it was just incredible that's like, bucket list shit right yes. there